Hello, everybody. My name is Bear. This is Wunderdoktor. It is what can probably be best described as a mix between Papers, Please and Little Inferno, which I know sounds very uh, peculiar. And this game indeed is peculiar from what I've played of it, at least. Uh, has a very interesting, quirky appeal to it. So uh, I'm going to go ahead and jump right in. I've played about 10 minutes or so, and I think that's about to, enough to give me the gist of what we'll be experiencing here. Not, not sure how long it is, but uh, I am I am intrigued enough to push forward here and check out Wunderdoktor. Hey there, little bird friend. Brings the news of the day. Weird diseases on the rise. Have you stacked up on potions? Medicine now more expensive than ever. Ghost sightings confirmed? Quack Co. Elixir. It brings mental sunshine. I could use some of that. Time for Act 1. Ring the bell. Peter Pipenbrink. An umbrella cutter. That's the kind of profession that's never going away, is it? Hello, Doctor. There's an itch on my face. I can probably help you with that. Pop. 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 Yeah, if you, if you like tuning into those zit-popping channels on YouTube, you're in for a treat, I bet. I don't think that's not, that's not the the gist of the entire game, by the way. I don't want you to think we're just going to be si sitting here popping pimples all day. Although, I mean, not too far away from that. The buzzing won't stop. I haven't slept for days. Uh, I mean, I can identify your issue pretty quick here. If I could just click the damn things. There we go. There we go. Back to work. Freshly cured. Well done. And we do, of course, have to dispose of the waste here in our furnace. There we go. Off you go. What is this? I don't actually know what this is over here. I'm I'm guessing I'll be uh, be instructed as to the the extra options we have available to us. Gregor Knoll, Tater Masher. Your head kind of looks like a big tater right now, buddy. Let's let's fix that up a little. Eyes go here. There's one. And then you know, like around uh, like like there. That looks probably okay. Gotta put a set of lips on you somewhere. Let's go ahead and put those like that. And uh, mustache usually goes between the eyes, right? Still need your hat. Definitely still need your hat. Right there on your shoulder. You gotta get going. <laughs> Alright, thanks, man. Glad we could take care of you. You're looking good. Off with you. This is great. Jurgen Suffelbeam. Pardon me the horrible pronunciations. Sold months worth of buttons for a couple of damn potions. Still, my head's starting to feel lumpy. Please help me, doctor. I can just go ahead and go a little bit of bat bam. Knock those out. Pop, pop, pop. It's your one stop shop. Let's get them out of here. Oh, wait, hold on. I got a couple more down there. Hidden ones. And then, oh my goodness, it just keeps getting worse. Disrobe and reveal. Nastiness below. Much better now. Out with you. Oh, hold on. Gotta dispose of that too. Alright. Bring him on in. I'm ready. Traveling doctor. Solving all the problems. <laughs> you think I got something in my eye? You think so, Kath? Please, doctor. I'm craving for some elixir. I don't have any elixir, but what I do have is a nimble dexterous set of fingers with which I can easily place that pupil back into position. I owe you my life! You sure do. How did you get here? How did you get on this train? Hans Mice! I'm gonna, I'm gonna call him Hans Mice for the whole bird theme. Greetings, Doctor. I bring good news today. We have a special offer for up-and-coming convergence like yourself. Every other respectable doctor already uses Quackco potions. Patients love it! I shall leave this form here. To get you started, 15 batches are recommended. I will be back shortly to collect your order. Have a good day, sir. Huh. Quackco. About that. That's right, they bring the mental sunshine. They need a minimum of 10 cases. I don't want to order that. I don't got any money. Just start it around here. Earn it to burn. I've been waiting forever. Well, get naked, lady. You know the story. You got pimples on your bra. That's no good. 
Oh, a couple of abrasions on there, too. My goodness, you need to take better care of your clothing, ma'am. And your body, I guess. You saved my life! Sure as shit did. Nice and easy so far. Sure things will be, uh... Cobble ja hello! Hi, friend! How's it going? You just gonna... You gonna hang out right here? Sorry for all the rumbling. Name's Stein. Medical assistant at your service. From now on, I shall aid you with the treatment of any, even uncurable diseases. Why, you ask? I like your style. You still try to actually cure people instead of just giving them those devil's potions. Shall we begin? Oh, one last thing. Please burn this quack co-order form, doctor. Their potions may alleviate pain, but they come with various side effects and lead to severe addiction. Yay! Oh, what fun. Now let's treat more weird diseases. Oh, his eye fell out. That's normal. What a beautiful day. <laughs> At least he's still optimistic. That candle on top of my head shows the patient's health. Don't let it burn down all the way. Even that's so oddly cheerful. We got pimples on the eyeball. My God, man. Haven't seen that one in a while. Okay, there we go. Bandage that up. He's still got a little bit more going on underneath. Careful, doctor. Try not to touch the red spikes. Good job. Now finish off their dusty remains. Oh, they're dead. Thanks. Uh, goodbye. Goodbye, Band-Aid Eye. Off with you. You got something going on over there. I think part of your brain was exposed, but I guess that's for a different doctor. Doris Sartig. My head's still aching, even though I drank three bottles of elixir. You look like you had three bottles of something else, lady. This patient really needs a schmonko pill. What's a schmonko pill? Is it this one? Have that. Nope. Nope. Oh, she died. Oh, shit. Oh, we just get to reset. Okay. Let's try this again, shall we? Just ignore the dead body. <laughs> Welcome back, Soap Boiler. I'm, I'm beginning to question these professions. I think people might have just filled out the forms without reading into it too much. Better have a look inside the old ledger. Feed her the double circle pill. Okay. What is this? What about the other books? I want to read the other books. Luckily, we can actually go back to that and keep reading it in case we forgot what the symbols were. Now you're getting the hang of it? Kill! Kill! The pain is gone, but the visions are still there. You go, you go have those by yourself, please. Ding-a-ling! Walter Panic! Candle maker! You feel spooked. It's probably because you got a live candle by you, dude. You, you haven't seen this in all your years of your profession, I imagine. I sense a ghostly presence, Doctor. A classic sign of Ephigia Confusa. I'm afraid this will make the treatment a bit more complicated. I'm ready for that. Bring it on. Oh, boy. Okay, yeah, that's a little freaky, isn't it? Okay, just don't touch the red thing. Pop all the pimples. No problem. Okay, so it shakes the screen up a little bit, but it's really not all that bad. Good, now slap the ghost away with a fast swiping motion from left to right. Bam! I must be going now. I'll have my shirt back, I guess. Good, good, good. Taken care of. I like that ghost swatting. Swat! Philip Failer, Mustard Man. My face feels kind of weird. Looks kind of weird, too. Please, doctor, give me... <laughs> you can't handle my strongest potions. I am the potion seller. Can't find anything, doctor? Use the magnifying glass and take a closer look. And do his soul! <laughs> Whoa, it's different! Oh, boy! Uh, that's his... Oh, it's because it's his skeleton. Oh, I see. I see what's going on here. Okay, we gotta just identify the up-close stuff. Better, but my stomach keeps on rumbling. 
Well, I can have a closer look at that too, pal. What you got? You, you. Oh, oh shit, we're running out of time here. Uh, okay, we gotta go quick with these. Scan it up. Scan it up. Uh, pop, 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 and got it. Woo. Sorry for the trouble. No trouble at all, buddy. I nearly let you die. That's, that's kind of my bad. I'm gonna be smarter here. Sonia Qualm, sauce tester. Thank you for taking. The t <laughs> Thank you for lighting up ahead of joining us inside here with your eyeballs hanging out of your skull and two devil's horns growing from your forehead. You no, know, you, you take this shit, put it out, get it out of here. Put these eyeballs back in your head real fast. There we go. What do you need? You need a heart circle. I can I can handle that for you. There you go. Nummy, nummy, nummy. Get rid of this shit. You need to pop the curtain here or no? I think we're good. You know what? You can have this back. You've earned it. Enjoy your smoke. Okay. Off with you. Who am I to say you can't smoke cigarettes if both of your eyes have popped out? Doctor, I have to go now. No time to explain. Okay, bye. Oh, you're back, Hans. Hi. So nice to see you again, Doctor. Everything filled out? Please hand over your order form and I will personally make sure your order gets here as fast as possible. What? You burned it? Shouldn't have done this, Doctor. Everyone needs our potions sooner or later. Don't get the hell out of my train car. Disrespecting my property. Yeah, that was close. They should probably explain a few things. Ugh, oh, <laughs> by coughing it out of my face. I used to work for Quackco. Oh, the recipe. Every day we would create potions to fool the sick. These potions were strong, but very dangerous. At first you would feel much better, but after a short while all you wanted was another dosage. After we created the elixir and saw what it did to people, I couldn't take it anymore. I wanted out. With some help, I escaped. I've been searching for a new place. A new doctor. As I left, I managed to get a hold of this secret potion recipe. Quackco did not want anyone to create this potion, and I have no idea why. We should brew it to find out. Make sure it doesn't harm anyone. I love that idea. And obviously, I gotta pull that, regardless of what it is. Oh, the almanac. Rusty nail. Three Goro beans and a magma heart. Hard to find. I see. Do not brew this. Noted. Okay, um, do I... What do I do? I just probably just put that back up, right? Looks like we need a rusty nail to start with. Should be easy. There's metal everywhere in these lands. Let's keep our eyes open. Well, the more stuff we burn, the more research scraps we can add to our almanac. Ah, cool. This way we can keep track of all the weird and curious things we encounter. Word. Bertabrocious. Asphalter. Getting all kinds in here. My body has been feeling bubbly as of late. Bubbly, huh? Ah, uh, let's find out why. Oh, that's why. You got bubbles in you. No, yeah, you got straight up bubbles inside your body. That would do it. Let's check out the inside of her skull as well. This is definitely a possibility of something up there. All right, okay, I think we found most of it. We gotta pop the bubble? We gotta pop the bubble. I got gotcha. you. I got gotcha. you, and then get this shit out of here. Don't let him come away. No, 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 no. You ain't escaping. You ain't escaping. There it goes. I don't know what to say, doctor. Say thank you and pay the receptionist on your way out. Goodbye. No rusty nail from that, unfortunately. Let's have a- okay, just to make sure there's nothing else going on here. Yeah, we're just checking in. Lucas Popstel, the paper bag maker. You kind of look like a paper bag. Doctor, I'm very sick. Oh, so terribly sick. Look at the sickness oozing from every pore of mine. Oh, my. I can see it. All the sickness. Hello, doctor. I'm still sick over here. You sure look it, pal. This man is perfectly healthy. I don't feel healthy at all, but you're the doctor, doctor. I'll show myself out then. Yeah, go ahead. Goodbye. What? Oh, he's gonna, he's coming back, isn't he? 
Jerk Bruler! Jerk, what happened, man? You are freaked out. Buddy, you can talk to me. I am the Wunder Doctor, after all. What you got going on? Couple bubbles. A little spike or two, no problem, no problemo butter. I got this. Ghost butter. It's a reference, developer reference. I'm looking out for him. Where's the other one? There it is. All right, good stuff. Need a couple band-aids, no problem. Probably gotta wait till we actually bandage these things up to be able to pop those, uh, spikes on there. Grab that. Yeah. Perfect. This patient could really use a syringe injection. What makes you say that? Well, sure, I mean, oh, well, the, the spider probably has something to do with it, right? Wait, what? How do I do this? Do I stab you with it? There we go. Many thanks, Wonder Doctor. You're welcome. Alright, we learned about rainbow injections today, too. The rainbow injection. That was... That was some sort of TV show or something, right? Karen Naswe. Asylum attendant, doesn't that... Doesn't that literally just mean you're insane? I've had this melody stuck in my nose for ages. Time to... Time to get melodical, but don't worry. Just follow my lead. Okay. Uh. Oh. Okay. Oh, it's musical. I can do this. Wait, not that. Oh, I love that. I know. I want more musical noses, please. Thanks. You bet. Bring your friends. We'll play musical noses all day. Bernhard Blahut. No, this is not what I want. You've been dying for a cigarette all day. You've been dying all day. Ignore the cigarette part. Okay, we got to pop the pimples on the flies and not hit the red spikes. Wow. Okay. We can do that. I can do that. No problem. Done. 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 Enjoy the rest of your issues. Including your upside down eyes and large, clearly a tumor on face. Not my problem anymore, I guess. Yay, resources! Ooh, and we get to pull the lever. Nice. What happened? Oh, this. Snot into sound. Yeah, no, we, we figured that part out. Pretty sure we're on top of that already. Andreas Vibkirsch? Vibkirsch. Hello, Doctor. Hello, Vibkirsch. What do you got? You need, um, uh, oh, pop the bubbles on your eyes. Understood. Come back down to here. We gotta get the magnifying glass out. There's a ghost for our additional difficulty. No worries, no worries. We're just gonna be. Nice and thorough here. Don't miss anything. There it is. Oh, he's letting the flies out. Damn it. Get this shit out of your goddamn flies. Where'd he go? Off the screen. There it is. Swat him out of here. Get that shit out of here. Thank you, Wonder Doctor. I am indeed the Wonder Doctor at your disposal. Good shit. Let's go. Off with you. Out the door. Swat you away like so many ghosts. Ingrid Todenvarth. Rag merchant. Got any more of them elixir potions, doctor? I can see an entire galaxy in your soul here. Da -na -na. Oh, shit. Sorry. Uh-oh. Oh, gotta get the injection in there. So we gotta, like, leave the needle right on the uh, X, I guess. And there we go, okay. A little bit of a chain reaction there. I'm starting to see how they're gonna put these things together. Gotta get going, no problem. Off you go. See, very papers pleasing in this approach of like dealing with one person's puzzle at a time, right? Oh my! This poor soul suffers from a shrunken face! He can't even talk! Oh goodness! Yeah! Oh god, I can feel my face again! Thank you very much! <laughs> Looks like it, man. <laughs> you feel a little bit more than that. 
think there was something in that injection. Franz Springensfeld. Please help me. Oh god, there's more than I think there is going on. Oh, he had his eyeballs disguised. He had me fooled thinking he had normal ass eyeballs going on here. Oh, whoops. Sorry, buddy. Don't want to disconnect them. There you go. I feel so great, I might just jump all the way home. I don't know why I made him sound like a f <laughs> Lose some weight. Oh, Rusty. Oh, good. Yeah, thanks, man. Never mind. Keep your pounds on. Just what we need for the recipe. Quick, stick it right into the blender next to me. That's a blender? Next, we need some Goro beans. Won't find them in this part of the country, though, so let's travel to Green Realm. They've had a catastrophic berry pimple outbreak. Good doctors are in sore need. Oh, sore need. I get it. It's a joke. That's, that's awfully clever, buddy. Really funny, just exploiting these people's horrible ailments. Act two, the garden folks. Lovely. Ooh, change of scenery. Green Realm, home of the fruity garden folks. People here are known for their hospitality and jovial nature, but some hold rather old fashioned views. I'm kind of worried to find out what that's going to be, but uh, let's find out. Joseph Grauber, wine merchant, carrot nose. Bless your heart, doctor. I fell asleep in the berry fields and now my body is hurting all over. Let's turn you around maybe and find out why. I don't know if I'm going to be dealing with anybody's backsides at any point. What in the heck is this? This is all very new stuff. You got anything on your face, pal? You sure do. Anything under that cabbage top? Nope. Okay, so we're going to... Not poke them when they're red, obviously. And then probably have to wait there. I see it. All right, no problem, no problem. The heart is pure and simple, sir. Sure is. I don't like being called simple, though, but I'll give you a pass considering you got a carrot for a nose and you probably can't think too much critically. Timon Hershberger. Butter carver, definitely not a thing. The patient seems to be awake and asleep at the same time. He suffers from eternal sleep. Slap him back to this world. Fuck yeah. Uh. Wake up, bitch. Where am I? No, a doctor. What a lucky coincidence. My stomach has been hurting a lot lately. You've also been asleep for a thousand lifetimes. Don't worry about that just yet. Okay, hold on, hold on, hold on. Be smart. Just a couple pimples. And a spider. Splat. What happened to you? I'm only slow for doctor. Drink a few bottles of nectar, blessed be it. Alright. Alright then. Seems like Quackco has developed a new potion. That's no good. Sarah Stoltzfub. Oh, you've got a myriad of issues, lady. Worms, worms, worms! Get them off me! Happily. Ah! Ew, ew, yuck. Get out of there. Oh, fuck. Sorry, dropped your eye. There you go. I gotta stop dropping people's eyeballs on the ground. At least I just barely got rid of that uh, spider crawling around over there. No! Come on. Blessed be, doctor. Just helping so many terrible looking people. <laughs> Here we go. What did we grab? Harvests around the year. What in the world? Alright. This is page two. This is getting very peculiar. Isaac Miller. Mueller. Mueller. Oh lord. My chest feels like something is crawling underneath. I'm just gonna go ahead and assume it actually is something crawling underneath you. Looks like we'll need the scalpel. Slice him open to see what's hiding under his skin! Yay! Oh, uh, like that. There we go, okay. I don't want to cut you in the wrong places, but I'm, I'm not really being given a lot of... ...specificity to my cutting location. A clear conscience is a soft pillow. 
How, uh... How wise of you, sir. Jonas! Your name is Jonas. You trust only the Lord. Gonna pop your pimples. Careful, dodge blows blood-sucking leeches. Okay. That doesn't feel good. Uh, oh, yeah, that, wow, what? Ah, ah, get off! Ah! Jesus! Get away! Okay. Cut. Cut. Precisely. There we go. And then... No, don't do that. Pop that. Get out of here. Ooh! Swat the ghost. Get out of here! Nice! Ooh! That candle was burning down. You owe me your life. You are damn right you do. That was a close one, man. Hot diggity. Okay, ring the bell. Rebecca Joder, this has gotten to be a pretty big issue up here, hasn't it? My body is weak. Another job for the scalpel. Be careful, don't cut the red spikes. We gotta go like this. Okay. Understood. Oh, I see. We're, we're, oh, we're pruning the tree here. Nice. That's our first bean. Quick, put it into the blender. This? It was on her face. That's disgusting. I guess there's not been much cleanly about this, is, has there been? Okay, yep, 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 yep. All the nastiness. She is going quick. Where is the other thing I need to find? There we go. Okay, pop, 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 pop. Get it, get it, good, and gone. And then inject right there. Put the band-aid on the abrasion. Oh! No! I lost her! Oh, geez. All right, it's getting a little crazier now. Let's reset this real quick. All right, I understand what's going on here. I understand what's going on here. Get that scalpel out for me, buddy. Let's do it. No more delays. I am the Wunder Doctor. It's our first bean. Got it. And there we go. Pull the lever. Pull the lever. Come on. Wasted way too much time on not our objectives in this first go. It's gonna be right there, gonna be right there. Got it, got it, got it. Okay, there's one more somewhere hanging out around here. Where is it at? Where is it at? There we go. Pop, pop. Get the worm, get the worm. And nailed it. Okay, get the injection. It's gonna be close again. Wait for it. Nice. Be blessed, doctor. Be blessed. All right. Getting a little more intense now. Looking for these beans. We're making progress on the recipe. We just need two more beans. Let's do it. Beans, please. Daniel Babok. Oh, town amuser. <laughs> Party doctor in the house. Wow. Woo. Savage train he got here. You seem all right. Gut. Gut. You ever want to party hard, come to our mansion and show this. Yeah, see you soon, Doc. And party on. You don't want me to get rid of the eggplant on your face? No, okay. All welcome at the party, an invitation to a party. Wow. What a merry man, indeed. He was so happy. So jovial. Okay. Well, this is exciting stuff. I'm going to go ahead and call it here for this episode of Wunder Doctor. I hope you have enjoyed the introduction to this. And uh, let me go, uh, or, you know, let me, let me know. If you'd like to see more here on the uh, Bear Taffy channel, if this is your first time here, go ahead and subscribe. Leave a like on the video as well if you did enjoy it. It does support me a great deal. Appreciate that a lot. And I'll see you next time.